Hey Brawlers, Cyber and so here back at it again with another Bakugan unboxing. Today we are going to be taking a look at two core Bakugan, core Dragonoid and core Hydrus. Here they are in their majesty. Here are the back of the boxes. You can see a collector sheet down here, or a collector's little panel thing with Diamond Dragonoid, Pegatrix, Dragonoid, Halcor, Hydrus, Nilius, Trox, and Feral. So yeah, let's get into them. So here are all the contents of the set. Each core Bakugan for Armored Alliance comes with the Bakugan itself, two Baku cores, a gate trainer, and a character card. So let's go over Dragos first. So here are the contents of Core Dragonoid set. Comes with the Armored Alliance Core Dragonoid. As you can see, as compared to the original uh, Dragonoid from the reboot, this one's actually a lot more smoother compared to him. So yeah, here are the two balls. Side view back view, and side view. So yeah, that's Dragonoid. And here are his cores. It's two fish, uh, fist back of cores. I stuttered there. This one gives you this, minus two damage points. And this one gives you plus 50 Bs and plus two damage points. That's neat. And here's its gate trainer with Dan Kuzo and Dragonoid and the little Pyrus faction symbol down there. And the back of Gun Armored Alliance logo. And if you don't know, gate trainers are used to practice your rolling. I'll get to that in a second. And here is its character card. Dragonoid, in the Armored Alliance variant, requires two fists to play, has 400 Bs, and does 4 damage. And if you land on a fist back of core, you get plus 6 damage points. How cool is that? So yeah, now on to Hydrus' set. And here are the contents of Hydrus' set. Comes with the Hydra's Core Armored Alliance variant, and it's really smooth looking, unlike the Bakugan Battle Planet Hydra's, who is a little more rougher. But they're still pretty cool looking, and I just love them. They're just so big and cool. I especially love the little orange highlights on his tail and light blue highlights on his mane and four legs and part of his tail. Or, I mean, hind legs specifically, actually, not his four legs. So yeah, that's Hydrus Corfria. And here are the cores. This one is a DNA backer core that gives you plus one frost strike ability. And this is a fist backer core that gives you plus two damage points. And here is its gate trainer with a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful illustration of the uh, character Shun Kazami in Armored Alliance, not to be confused with the original Shun from the original series with Hydra snarling up here, and the Armored Alliance logo, and the little Aquas faction symbol. So yeah, now onto his character card. This is the Hydra's character card. It requires a DNA and a fist back core to play. Has 400 Bs and does 4 damage. And if you land on a DNA back core, you get plus 500 Bs and plus 5 damage points. Now that is awesome. And now onto the roll. So the gate trainers are in their positions, and your goal is supposed to land on these little mark things or any other of these little parts. So yeah, that's really what a gate trainer is all about, just practicing your rolling. So first, we're going to roll Dragonoid on here. Are you ready, brawlers? Three, two, one, Bakugan brawl! Bakugan stand! And here he is. Just look at him. He's so slim, and he looks less chonky than his battle planet form. So I gotta focus in on him here so I can see him clearly. Here is his Bakugan battle plan form, and he, like I said, he looks less chonky than him. Looks like he lost some weight, and yeah, he's a little taller than him as well, making him extra cool. And also his little horn is manual as well, so you can pull it out like that. And I just love him. He also has these little pegs where you can place little peg back of gear in. Yeah, that's cool. And like I said, he has 400 Bs. So yeah, that's Armored Alliance Dragonoid for ya. Now on to Hydrus. And now it's Hydrus's turn. Are you ready, brawlers? Three, two, one, Bakugan brawl! Bakugan stand! And look at this guy. So a cool looking dude. The coolest cat on the block, Hydrus. And unlike his battle plan form, 
It seems that Hydrus has gotten way more chunky. Fun. So here are the two, and they're just so cool looking. And I just love how chunky he is. Just look at this flabby tabby. And yeah. And Hydrus seems to be a bit longer than him. So he got a little scrunched up too. So yeah, and he is 400 beasts, just like Dragonoid, and just like I stated when showing off his card. So yeah, and his little claws here are tipped orange and really cool. So he can slice you. Meow, 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 roar. So yeah, that's Hydrus for ya. Well, that's all the time we have for this unboxing. Remember to leave a like, drop a comment, and if you're nice enough, subscribe to this channel for more content. And can't get enough of these badass battling beasts? Well, hit the notification bell to be updated on any new Bakugan unboxings I make. And I'll catch all of you on the flip side. Bye!